Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Advice to Think Twice. My name is Monica and I'm here with your weekly advice reading for the week starting October 23rd, 2017. This is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, and Rising Signs. Um, and as always, please remember they are general readings, so they're not going to apply to everyone. Watch your Moon and Rising Sign reading for additional messages. And if you're interested in private readings, all the information you need um, is in the description box below. So let's have a look at what's going on here for you. Your overall guidance, we have Indriel. You're a light worker. God needs you to shine your divine light and love like an angel upon the earth and all of its inhabitants. So for some of you, this is a week where you're going to take the lead in a situation. You're going to be the teacher or the guide or the expert in a situation or people will come to you and ask for information, ask for help, ask for guidance because they think you're going to know what they need to know or tell them what they need to do. Um, it's also uh, a week for you to lead by example. Try not to get too involved or try not to get, let other people get you involved too much in their own problems, their own drama, their own relationships. It's a week for you to focus on yourself and lead by example, okay? Um, you may be asked to help okay is what i'm getting with this you may be asked to help someone give them a place to stay or give them money or give them guidance and information there's also a message here that says okay try to keep the balance between what you do for others and what you do for yourself um it's very very important that you do not neglect yourself and your needs at this time this is a good week to travel for some of you or you may receive um good news that is cause for celebration or you may receive news or visitors um from different places in the world or across the world um during this time and you may be offered a position that involves you heading something or you speaking giving information providing support um, during this time as well. So for career and finances, and this also includes your studies, personal projects, and business, we have the Magician. So the Magician is a major arcana card that tells you that this week uh, can be a really great week for you. It could be a week where you start something new. So you could get the job, you could get the promotion, you could get the money that you've asked for, that, that you've applied for. For those of you who are turning theory into practice so i do feel that you're completing some sort of a training program or a course or a degree um or a qualification of sorts and you're applying it you're starting to implement um that knowledge that you've acquired into your day-to-day -day practice of your job or whatever this is um and i do feel that it comes with a fresh start attached to it so it could be that now with that degree or with that qualification you can ask for more money you can ask for a better job you can ask for anything like that for others of you you are working on a paper you are working on your business you're working on your blog you're working on um, your book um, whatever this is okay and you will be very very inspired uh, during this time so really sit down and focus you're gonna get a lot accomplished good news comes to you about a new beginning with this energy so it could be that you're getting the good news to in terms of you get to move you get the house you get the money you get the job um there is something that you're gonna have to put together whether that is a file or um going through the paperwork uh signing things and then returning them to your employer or the bank or whoever this is so you're gonna have to be hands-on to get a lot accomplished and tie off loose ends and dot the I's and cross the T's. But there's something new that is starting for you during this week, okay? So that's awesome. And again, for some of you, it could be a role as a teacher, uh, a guide, someone's mentor, um, or you could be starting an apprenticeship of sorts with this energy as well, or you're starting in a new field, something that you've been studying but you don't have a lot of experience in, so it's a new field to you. It's not a field that you've worked in before, and you're starting a new direction, okay? For your communications environment, we have the Six of Swords. So the Six of Swords here, 
it's definitely good news to do with moving uh, coming up for um, some of you for others this is definitely a week where you're gonna help someone out um, and it could be even you know giving them a, a temporary place uh, where they can stay for a few nights um, while things calm down in their lives um, it could also be for some of you what I'm getting with this is that you're adopting or you get to take your kids home or if you if someone you love uh, a sibling or um, a friend or anyone has had issues and they've had to go to hospital you get to take them home during this time good news about travel travel arrangements and compensation coming to you from any issues with traveling with this energy as well so receiving news about that um, for those of you I feel that you're choosing to turn your back on um, a conflict maybe with an air sign Gemini Libra Aquarius you're choosing to turn your back you're choosing to take the high road you're choosing to remove yourself from that situation because it's toxic you've done everything you could with it and it's it's not gone anywhere good so this is the time for you to say okay well I've done everything that I could so I just have to save myself at this point okay um definitely help from friends and family coming in for you here good news about cars transport transportation um also coming in for you and i feel that you may receive a lot of either news or signs because it's at night either you're driving at night or you are working at night um or you're dreaming and you're receiving a lot of information a lot of um, messages in your dreams because I feel that a lot of information comes to you at night during this week or significant information will come to you at night for your challenge we have the Hierophant so the challenge with the Hierophant is red tape bureaucracy uh, jumping through hoops because that's what you have to do uh, just going through the motions, going through the process, even though there may be a way to streamline everything, you can't, you have to go through the process that's already been set in place. Um, it, it can be frustrating, it takes patience and it takes time, but it's going to be one of those situations where you have to do what you have to do, especially if you are going to work for the government, um, a big corporation, um, schools, anything in education. It's going to take time for the process to be completed whether this is an application process or it's about receiving the results of something you've applied for um or exams or anything like that it's going to take some time for others of you there may be challenges with family or within the family again so you may be stepping up to help someone in the family or you may be asked to step in and be the mediator in a situation to do with family um and a Taurus person in your life, Sun, Moon, or Rising, may cause issues or challenges um, during this time. Try to stay patient. It's also a reminder to play by the rules, okay? Play by the rules during this time um, is very important, very, very important. So even if something seems useless or pointless, if it's a rule, you have to abide by it, okay? So just keep that in mind. For your emotional life and love life, we have the Eight of Pentacles. So this is about, for some of you are going to therapy to work out your own emotions, to work through pain, to work through trauma. Um, and it's going to go very well for you, so try to stick with it, okay? Take it slow, go through the motion, go through the process. For others, this could be the 12-step program that you're getting yourself involved in or enrolled in uh, or getting started with uh, during this time. It will do you a lot of good. For others, this is the beginning of a new relationship, okay? Uh, maybe with an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Sun, Moon, or Rising. Um, this person likes to take their time and do things right, okay? So just get to know each other. Um, and just take it slow. Uh, it could be someone you work with, it could be someone you meet through school or um, anything to do with a course you're taking. Um, and for others of you who are already in relationships, um, this is about things finally smoothing out within that relationship. 
you've done a lot of work the both of you have and it's finally showing because things are calming down within the relationship uh, and you're starting to feel like you're actually building um, in that relationship okay as opposed to just going one step forward two steps back so that's a beautiful thing for others of you you're very focused on your work and very focused on your studies um, you could say you know I don't have time for a romantic life right now or it's your work that gives you emotional fulfillment and that's also a great thing because you have good news coming in with that as well so that is your reading for the week i hope that it makes sense and i hope that it helps let me know what it's talking about for you if the messages apply thank you so much for joining me um, for liking for sharing for subscribing have a wonderful week i'll talk to you again very soon take care